So doctors often ask me, Anissa, how is it that you can have your patients referring patients to you over and over again without spending a lot of money on marketing? Well, inside of this video, I'm gonna share with you one simple thing that you can do every single month to make that happen. I'm Dr. Anissa Holmes, the founder of Delivering Well Education, and inside of this channel, we give you tips and strategies to help you grow your practice faster. Make sure to subscribe and hit the bell to be notified of future episodes. So I often have doctors asking me in seminars or events or in our marketing program, Anissa, how is it that you have patients who are referring more and more patients to you without having to spend a ton of money on Google ads, a ton of time doing lots of crazy marketing strategies. And so I wanted to share with you in this video something that you are probably not doing that can make a huge impact. Well, before we get into what that strategy is, one thing that I want you to really think about is what do you want your patients to say about your practice? Do you want them to say that you are an expert in specific services? Do you want them to see that you're really serving the community hard? Now, in the last video, we actually talked about having a free day of dentistry. If you've not yet watched that video, make sure you watch that video. But when you're having free days of dentistry or when you're having a gift card giveaway with other businesses, perhaps you're doing a clothing drive, it's really important to let your patients know what you're doing. The question often comes up, well, how do we keep them in the loop? One thing that's very powerful is actually implementing a monthly marketing newsletter. Now, what does that mean? That means that every single month, you're actually sending out an email to your patients, letting them know what's going on in the practice. And that means that you obviously have to plan and prepare and have things going on. And so if you're having something like a clothing drive and you had a clothing drive last month, Share images of your practice collecting the clothes, donating the clothes to the missionaries of the poor or whatever charity. That shows your patients that you really care about your community. That shows your patients that you're out there serving the community and that the community where you live really matters. And so as you're building your newsletter, one of the things that I recommend that you do is you always have photos talking about what the practice did last month. So the next thing that you want to put inside of the newsletter is what you're planning for this upcoming month. And so if this upcoming month, for example, you're doing a free day of dentistry, it's a great way to be able to involve your patients, to let them know what you're doing so that they can help spread the word for you. And what's really exciting is that if you're doing videos, for example, on YouTube, or you're doing videos on Facebook, et cetera, now what you can do is you can actually share that video with within your email and what that's going to do is it's going to drive more people to actually see those videos and put it out to more people for free. These monthly newsletters are also an incredible opportunity to be able to feature a different service every single month. And so this allows you to go in and to let your patients know what procedures you absolutely love helping other patients with. Maybe you have a video testimonial of a patient sharing. Maybe you have before and after pictures. Maybe you're including an article where people can learn a little bit more. And of course, inside of these newsletters, you are always going to want to have a button where your patients can schedule an appointment for you. And what's really exciting is that if you're doing funnels, collecting emails from email marketing from people who are not yet your patients, you can actually send this patient newsletter to those people as well. I remember when COVID hit and we wanted to really get the word out when our practice opened back up. And I had this idea, oh my gosh, we've been emailing our patients, but we also have this email list of people who have given us their email over the years for our implant funnel, for our Invisalign funnel. And so if you're collecting those emails, you can now send out your monthly newsletter to people who are not yet your patient. Again, giving you an opportunity every single month for them to get to know you over and over again, learning about all of your services, and again, giving them an opportunity to schedule an appointment. 
If you're not yet using a monthly newsletter, I highly encourage you to get started today. It is extremely powerful for you to be able to show your patients as well as non-patients what your practice is up to, what you're known for in terms of dentistry, and give them an opportunity to come in and make that appointment. I'm Dr. Anissa Holmes. In the comments below, I would love to hear your biggest takeaways. And if you've not yet accessed our free marketing training, check out the link below. Again, Dr. Anissa Holmes, and I'll see you in the next video.